Fabi, congratulations. Thank you we so much. We are just thrilled from you, New Yorker through and through. Yeah. And wow, what a success. Thanks so much. Tell Thanks us about me. the new show. Uh, it's called Me, Myself, and I. I play uh, a character named Alex Riley, who is uh, an inventor. Um, and you see him at three different stages of his life. You see him at the age of 14, played by Jack Dylan Grazer uh, in, in 1991. Uh, you see him at the age of 40 in 2017, played by me. And uh, at the age of 65 in 2042, played by John Larroquette. What a great concept for a yeah. show. Are you having a good time with it? Uh, I am. I'm, I'm having a, a wonderful time. Uh, everybody there is, is wonderful. Dan Culpeman, the writer, is phenomenal. All the writers are, are, are amazing. They're doing a bang-up job. Uh, every episode seems to get better and better. And uh, the cast is phenomenal. Julia White, Brian Unger, I mean, John Larroquette, Jack Dylan Grazer, Mandel Maughan, everybody, Kellen Coleman, just uh, a wonderful group of, of really talented people. I'm having a good time. Tell me, what was your reaction when you found out you got the show? Uh, it was it was nice. Um, <laughs> uh, I read the script and they, they they came to me and it was more the decision of, of what to do. You know, was I going to leave SNL or you know whatever? And it just seemed uh, it seemed right. It seemed like a, a really fun, wonderful project that I could uh, do something with. So I was very happy. So many of us have just laughed with you for years on SNL. Was Thanks. that a difficult decision? Of course, yeah. yeah. I mean, it was it was my life's dream to be on that show. I, I love that place. I still do. I always will. Uh, it's. It's harder now, now that I know it's coming back. It's it's very weird. I'm having my SNL nightmares are coming back, <laughs> waking up with hoping I have an idea for that week. Uh, but yeah, no, it's been it's been it's been crazy. It's it's weird. It's weird to move past it. But take us into your mind just for one moment about those days leading up to uh, Saturday night and uh, what that was like for you. It was crazy, especially that last week. It was very emotional for me. I'm a very emotional guy, and uh, it was it was hard. It was rough. Uh, it's more just it's the people you meet there, the friends that you make, and the, these unbreakable bonds of just. It's a pretty high pressure job, and it's not for everybody. And you you have to get out there and do live television every week. And there's a lot of crazy stuff going on in the world right now. And it felt like it felt like we were helping to make people laugh and helping to make the world a little happier. You sure so do, all the it time. Was a, it was the best, it was the best. Which character will you take with you and you, did you just love playing? Uh, Drunk Uncle was super fun. I, I love doing <laughs> that always. I, I always loved, I always skewed more towards the weirder, uh, more obscure characters that I only got, <laughs> got on once or twice. Uh, yeah. I think like on the second to last episode, uh, Brian Tucker, one of the writers, and I wrote this sketch where I played uh, an actor named Sal Delabate who was going to be on Star Trek. And yeah, it was, of course, it was, just, it was a very silly, <laughs> weird sketch. But uh, yeah, th those were kind of my favorite. Those mm -hmm. those little minor characters that maybe 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 shouldn't have been on television, <laughs> <laughs> but, but made yeah. it on, and we yeah, started yeah, laughing yeah. with it. Made me laugh. So now you're out west. Uh, yeah, but your family is in New York. The uh, cousins uh, yeah, and the family. Yeah, I grew up, I grew up in Westchester, uh, in Eastchester. So they're 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 still out here. Yeah, um, I'm out there with my my wife and daughter. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Well, uh, and, and how has that transition been, uh, the big move? Uh, you would think it would be, it would be crazier. Uh, it, it, I, just a lot of changing diapers and going to work and then going home and immediately changing diapers. That's, <laughs> it's a lot of that right now. <laughs> well, we wish you the best. Thank Great you so much. You. I appreciate it. Great to see it. you. Thank, Thank you. you.